Yo, so guys, it's Leo here, and today you're watching Rapping Manual. I'm only climbing up and no, I'm never coming down. Am I so serious? I'm fucking delirious. The flow is mysterious. Fast like the furious. Hold up your head, it's quit with your silly. For some rap advice, uh, some advice that I've gotten since I've been rapping for about a year or so was to develop my own style and uh, keep that style. Like, you don't want to sound like every other rapper out there and have other people listen to the same exact stuff every day. So, learn your own style. And a way that I um, developed my own style was uh, by inspiration from a rapper named Russell, also known as Pride or Deep Pride, if you guys know him back in the day. Uh, he still makes music now, and his music is fire. Um, he, his style is uh, based off his passion for for uh, rapping and music in general. Uh, he takes his past stories and whatnot and puts them in a song, talks about it, and sticks with that theme. And that's kind of what I do with my music, but since I don't have a rough past like he did, I just find little things throughout the day or throughout my life in general and just talk about it in a song and stick with one theme. Uh, I don't like to, for me personally, I don't like to just ramble on different different parts of the song and like different lyrics and lyrics make no sense whatsoever. So I liked my songs to have some form of uh, story to it. Another key advice is uh, learning to expand yourself. Like don't be afraid to let other people listen to your music and give you um, criticism. Like don't be afraid of criticism. Criticism is one of the best things for you to listen to as far as trying to become a better rapper. Like criticism, constructive criticism, should I should say, um, is one of the main things you should listen to and uh, learn from it. Like people tell you, oh, this song could uh, be better by doing this or doing that. Like learn from that, use it, and then you can make a better song moving forward. Uh, with that being said, you can also network with anyone around you that has the same passion or is in the same field as you. Uh, like, I have two friends behind me, I don't know if you can see them. I have two friends behind me that love EDM music and love uh, producing and making their own uh, songs. And um, me, these two, and a bunch, uh, maybe like three other people, or two other people, uh, have the same passion and hobby. And so we work together, criticize each other, whatnot. And we come out, we're just bumping bangers back and forth, back and forth. Um, so don't be afraid to network. And also, if you know friends or family that are in the that are in the industry of music, and you would like to collaborate or work with them, don't be afraid to uh, hit them an email or a text. Uh, you know, nothing, nothing bad can go wrong out of it besides them saying no, obviously. But uh, don't be afraid to network. Let let yourself expand and work with other people. And as far as uh, the last piece of advice that's very crucial to making music is being dedicated and having a passion for it. You don't want to make music and not be happy when you're doing it. You want to have fun with uh, when you're making music, obviously. Like the, the first thing that goes into your mind is that if you're having fun making music. If you're not, if you're not having fun when making music, you're, you're, it's going to translate into your music and it's going to sound not as good as you want it to be or other people around would think to be. So you want to have fun, obviously, and you want to have a passion for it. If you stay 100% dedicated to it and you're very passionate, uh, your work is going to show uh, one day and you'll be big. And that's all I got for you guys today. Thank you for watching Rapping Manual. Leave a like, subscribe down below, comment, and check out my SoundCloud.